Hello and a warm welcome. This is the scene here at the Orange Vélodrome. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting next to me here on the commentary gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham United midfield man, Stuart Robson. And with the game just moments away now, this really ought to be a superb watch. It's France versus Argentina. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out, who will affect the game, and who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. Here's the side France will go with. Hugo Lloris begins in goal. Rafael Varane plays alongside Presnel Kimpembe at the back. Paul Pogba plays with N'Golo Conte in the centre of the park. And up front, Karim Benzema plays alongside Kylian Mbappe. The Argentina first team. Emilio Martinez is the goalkeeper. Lionel Messi starts with Angel Di Maria on the flanks. And leading the line, Lautaro Martinez. And the match is underway. N'Golo Conte on to Benzema Griezmann wonderful tackle Molina Rodrigo de Paul strength and control a big part of his game well, that's a well-timed pass and a fine stop. Short corner it is. High quality defending. Martinez Pogba has it well it's impossible to have Lionel Messi in the starting lineup and not talk about what he does so well I would describe him as majestic when he's playing at his best he glides past defenders he's got that ability to run with the ball into open space he can pick out a pass he can wriggle out of tight situations he's the most creative. oh hang on Stuart look at this Losing possession. Martinez! Well, the post got in the way. High degree of difficulty to hit it on the volley like that, and it was close. Well, his skill level is so high, you're absolutely right. That's a great effort on the volley. Paul Pogba and Varane under pressure disappointing pass Messi 
now with Martinez and a goal now they have their opener and now they can celebrate well here's another look and you can see what a good finish this is he holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure that's a great goal And France gets the ball moving again. Can they come up with an answer here? Benzema. Conte has it. Benzema. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. Well, as you can see, Argentina have found it difficult to control the tempo of the game here. But that won't bother them because when they win it in deep areas, they've got forward with pace and with numbers. It's been a great counter-attacking display. Yes, and maybe another break brewing here. Lionel Messi. Di Maria. Could be marvellous anticipation. And a short corner, let's see. Di Maria. And blocked for now. In the opinion of the referee, that is a penalty. And a chance for 2 0. And there it is, perfectly executed. Well, here it is again, and just watch the keeper. He stands still, hoping it's hit down the middle. Unfortunately for him, he's got it wrong. So back underway with the scoreline standing at 2 0. Look at Dinia. This is Coman. Went in strongly, decisively. Martinez. Martinez. Messi, Marcos Acuna, now with Di Maria, a really top-notch piece of defending, in position, and there it is, three goals in front now, an immense performance. Well, as you can see, his movement is really good, which then makes the finish look easy. That's a decent goal, that's for sure. Well, you've got to say, an incredible first-half performance. That scoreline tells you all you need to know. Well, there it is. The first half is now in the history books here at the Orange Velodrome. So back underway here into the second half.
using his strength to shield the ball. It's looking promising. Chance here. In it goes! Such a complete performance. Four in front now. Well, as the replay shows, this is all about his ability to find space in the box, which then makes the finish look so much easier. That's good play from him. And this is turning into something of a rout. 4-0. N'Golo Conte. Now Griezmann. And the referee spotted the foul, but has played advantage. Conte. Well taken away, he won the ball. Well, those stats don't surprise me. Argentina have certainly had more of the ball. They've passed it well, their movement's been good, and they've been well worth their lead. Could get even better here. Yes, who knows? Maybe another opportunity in the works for them. And it's a double for him in this game. No way for the opposition to contain him. And no wonder he's off celebrating. Well, here's the replay. What a pass this is from Martinez. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. Well, it's been such a one-sided game. You just wonder how many more they could add. 30 minutes to go then. Physically strong and secure on the ball. Coman. And Benzema in the middle. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the opportunity. Benzema. Return to Coman. Karim Benzema. Offside by a fraction. And they're making a change. What a Mendy. Firing it towards goal. And what a close shave it was. And it is substitution time at this juncture. Not just from one side, but from both. Twenty minutes to go in this one. Ball's gone. Messi. Messi. Oh, managing to beat him. Messi. Well, a top-notch piece of defensive judgment. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. N'Golo Conte. Nkunku. Surely! It's gone in! And well, he might celebrate on the back of that! Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box, just begging someone to get on the end of it. And he does well to read the flight of the ball, to be fair. Almost just cushions it beyond the goalkeeper, and that seemed to catch him off guard. A really good, controlled finish. Victor! 
a glut of goals. 5-1 it is. Rodrigo de Paul. The ball with Martinez. Getting forward. Di Maria. Return to Martinez. An important interception. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Will it be sufficiently imaginative? Coman. Here's Mbappe. Vital interception. The danger was very real. Ben Yedder. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. Excellent vision. Di Maria. Using his strength to hold on to the ball and wait for team. And it goes into the history books as a win for Argentina. A very satisfactory outcome. Stuart, your analysis. You're absolutely right, Derek. Their attacking play was excellent, full of energy and pace, and the midfield completely dominated the game. It was a great all-round performance. We have a hugely influential role played by Lautaro Martinez. Sensational performance from him on all levels. Stuart, what did you make of what you saw? Well, he gave that back line a torrid time, didn't he? He was far too sharp for them, always looking to play on the shoulder, took his goals well too. Clearly the difference maker today.